Me torch, but this um, I told you guys I'm coming back with more bangers and shit, and I'm coming out with more videos, YouTube videos and shit. And it's kind of late, but um, I gotta make this feed. Um, but yeah, um, I'm gonna talk about um, more potential boxing fights that are coming up. As you can tell, I, I kind of uh, um, made like a different kind of uh, page for this. But uh, this will be this will be my account for music and also uh upcoming boxing fight and shit. Because as you know I box as well. Um but yeah, um yeah we're gonna see what um boxing fights are uh coming up in twenty twenty one. I heard there's a couple of good ones. There's been a couple of good female ones as well. Um but um yeah, let's go get it. And um by the way I box so um I, I'm also like really good at um telling um form and shit. But I'm just really just for now he is like he's better edge and who I think is gonna win on this. So here we go. And I'm gonna leave the clip down here so everybody can see. Will it happen? Maybe. It might, because it might be one of those fights that the fans clamor for more than any other fight. I think that the fight will happen, and uh, as far as who's going to win the fight, I think it's going to be a tough time. Yeah, I think Canel got this. I think Canel got this. The way he did, the way he did my son Saunders, bro. Nigga, man. Nigga fucking busted his eye, bro. He has power, bro. You gotta see, like, this guy has power, bro. And he is like, he's really good at heavy movement. If you got good heavy movement, you can move out punches. And if you have really good power, you can um, land shots while ducking them. It's just, I don't know if his stamina is going to go match with this guy. Um, it's just about like um, good uh, cardio and stuff. But yeah, this guy, I think this guy got this, bro. Canelo, I think Canelo over anybody, but yeah, let me see this. Triple G to be able to beat this Canelo that we yeah, see. Yeah, it might be a guy Triple G. So. I think yeah. Canelo wins this fight clearly. You had to give the edge. Obviously, you would give the edge to Canelo. But Triple G is somebody that you cannot sleep on. I think either way, at 160 or 168, it's going to be an incredible fight, just like the first and the second one. But hope oh, so they're fighting at 160, 168. You know, I thought, I, um, I, I, I'll, go, I'll, I'll usually. If I was going to box or, you know, go, like, in the ring, so yeah, I would fight around, like, 190, if if possible. But, but the most I could, like, that's the most I could cut down to. But if it was coming coming to, like, like cruiserweight and stuff like that, or even heavyweight, I could come I could go close to, like, 210, maybe, at the most. But, yeah, I've seen, seen these fighters, um, yeah, fighting that, 160, 168, that's kind of a light. It's, it's light for the, it's for light for them, basically. But, um, yeah, I think the fighters cut down more than that. Okay. Hopefully, if it does happen, we get a definitive win. Oh, well, we're getting two of the best fighters. So we got the ones coming up next. Um, Taylor and um, Toronto. Uh, I think Taylor Gass is on too, man. I see him training with Jake Paul. I don't like Jake Paul, bro. I don't like him at all. He's a fucking scumbag. But, um, yeah, I think, I think, um, she got this. Isn't she gonna be on this, under this card, I think? I think she's gonna be, she's gonna be on this card. But I respect her, bro. Like, no one got power, bro. Some people are saying, like, she's gonna be, like, the next woman with the most knockouts and everything like that, but. We'll see. It's just, we can't. We gotta sleep on Toronto though. We gotta see what she's up to too. Hold on. 
is on the planet. I mean, this is a pound for pound, uh, meaning another pound for pound uh, great. That's a fantastic fight between two uh, amazing fighters, and, and it'll be probably the, 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 the best women's fight you could possibly make right now. You have Katie Taylor, who might be pound for pound. The K best K uh, all Katie Taylor, yeah. Fox, and Amanda Serrano, the multi division yeah. world champion, who leapfrogs from 150 yeah. pounds all the way up to 140 and possesses blunt power in each one of those weight classes. She got a good, um, she got a good, um, got a good uppercut. She got a good uppercut. We have seen Katie Taylor in some force. That jab, she, she, she got a good jab, too. Look at her first, yeah, I got that, yeah. She got a good form. She got like her arms a little low, but she got a good form. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, that's what Spence and uh, Spence, we got Spence, Spence and Spence Jr. and uh, Aerosmith. We wish we could just break it up and put these two entities together. And if there's ever been in there, I got Spence too, bro. I got Spence, but I like this other nigga too. This other nigga got, they got, um, I mean, Spence, we got Spencer Crawford. Spencer Crawford, but um, yeah, I think, I think. Spence got this, right? Oh yeah, bro. We gotta see this, bro. We gotta see this. Hold on. I gotta talk about this real quick. Gervonta Davis and Ryan Garcia, bro. Let's talk about this real quick. This nigga got speed, bro. Then he break a couple like, like um, world records and shit. This nigga got speed, bro. Like he can fucking punch for speed, like like speed. He has good stamina too. I seen this nigga take a break. I don't know if this nigga is gonna fucking catch up to him. If the break gonna catch up to him. Because when you take a break for a long period of time and go back in the ring, um, you don't really fight the same like like you don't really fight the same. You know like I can tell like people when they like even if they're going to like a brawl, let's say like they're going to a brawl, or even MMA, or let's say okay, let's say a brawl, right? If you if you don't fight for like a long period of time, you're not gonna be used to getting hit. Or even like getting hit, or even like, or like, or or your stamina. Let's say your stamina is not gonna be to par because you're taking a break, right? And you're, you're like enjoying yourself, right? I don't know if this is gonna catch up to um, Ryan because you know if you go back in the ring and you go against like someone that's been training and actually fighting while you were on the break. And he being, and he, and he, I think this, um, Geronda even watching, um, I think he watched, I think he watched, uh, the Ryan Garcia and, um, uh, Ryan Garcia and, uh, Ortiz, no, no, Ortiz, I think, the other one, I forgot his name, but I'll say, uh, if, I, if, if you guys can remind me what fight he had, that got him in, that guy, um, that guy in the stomach, that's the guy he got. I can't run, I can't I keep forgetting his name, but if you know who that was, tell me down below. But Geronde saw that fight and to me I think he wasn't that impressed. And for a guy that's not impressed, I think that's uh, either two ways could happen. He could underestimate Ryan or he could really take a hard, take it take into fact that he has knockouts and he's gonna train harder than he Usually he does for this fight. He knows this fight is gonna be big. I know he does. That's why I like putting on a show. This nigga, this this man, like Floyd, Floyd, Floyd knows. Floyd knows, man. Floyd knows that he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna make money with this fight. So we'll see, we'll see. But Ryan, but I don't know if this this the break's gonna catch it to Ryan. I think I think we're gonna we're gonna find out. I feel like if I was Ryan, I'd take a small fight, like a small fight. Uh, something, uh, something, bro. It could be under like, under like, like a private fight. It could be a private fight, even that. But um, bro, I, I don't know. If we're going out to against or, um Gervonta, bro. It's gonna be a little. That's gonna be a little bit hard for you, I think. If you don't, if you don't, if you if you don't take it seriously, if you don't take it really seriously, I think this guy got good speed, but. No, we got it. We we haven't seen we haven't seen neither of these guys face guys like 